It's been an exciting finish, this one. It is. I mean, it was a really important game for us, you know, but 
Like on the beginning, we didn't play good defense, you know, and they scored lots of easy points. And after we started playing uh, zone defense, you know, we, I mean, we tried to play uh, really hard. I think, you know, the, in the last uh, five minutes, you know, we put everything what we can do, you know, and we win the game. You've uh, come up really strong for your team tonight, 22 points, 10 rebounds. It's been a, a great game for you. Yeah, it is. I mean, I try to do everything to win the game, you know, because before we win like uh, four games in a row, you know, and if we lose this one, it's all those four games going to be like for nothing, you know, and that's uh, why we have to play a little bit more harder. And uh, I mean, tomorrow it's going to be a more important game against Slovenia, you know, if we play really hard, like today we can win the game also. And it's the battle to finish first tomorrow. What can we expect? I mean, it's going to be a really tough game because Slovenia really have uh, lots of big guys who can shoot three-point shot, you know, and uh, lots of point guys who can shoot three points also, you know. If, if we play go, uh, good uh, pick and roll defense, we can win the game. Catch your breath. I know you're breathing a sigh of relief. This is a, a great performance from your team. Yeah, we've been struggling for, uh, for the whole tournament until today. And today was not a perfect game at all, but we play with a lot of more intensity, a lot of more energy, passion, and... Uh, I think that's why uh, we won this game. Now, after this game, we, we have learned what we have to do every day if we want to be a competitive team and we want to be fighting for the medal. So uh, I think we will we learn a lot from this game. What was going through your mind when you were losing 24-15 to 15 early on? Exactly what we talked about before, uh, uh, before the game. We were talking about they are a very talented team, maybe young team, but very, very talented and very skilled team. And we have to be ready for this kind of moments. We, we were... Tough uh, mentally, uh, we overcome the situation uh, like a, like a team like we want to be. And once and for all, is this team unified and together and ready to go all the way here at the Eurobasket? Always, we have been always together, and I don't know what's going to be the, the final uh, the final result of our team, but for sure, whatever happens, we are going to be we're going to get it uh, together. Your thoughts on this win? Yeah, we knew that it's going to be a tough game, you know. Uh, okay, we won by 16 points, you know, but uh, we didn't start the game so well defensively. Uh, we let not get too, too many easy baskets. But then, you know, in the second quarter and third, you know, we pick it up with strong defense uh, and uh, we're a better uh, opponent tonight. Usually in the first quarter and the last few games, you've been able to get a three-point shooting going. You didn't have that today. What did you do? Exactly, yeah. We didn't make shots, uh, you know, in the first quarter. But it was kind of interesting, you know, to play uh, the game from behind, you know. All those games, even in uh, Warsaw, you know, we play uh, from advantage, you know. Uh, Nagbar and Lakovic made those early shots, you know, previous games tonight, they were a little cold in the first quarter, but no matter what, you know, we know, uh, we know our strength, you know, good defense, and uh, we just got to keep playing like that and improve our game. Your last game against, uh, it'll be against Turkey, what are your thoughts on that one? Yeah, you know, we said before the European uh, Championship started, you know, we're going to play every game uh, as is our last one, you know, so we're going to play every game uh, to win, and against Turkey, you know, it's going to be for the first position, you know, and uh, it's going to be a tough game, and uh, hopefully we can win this one. Being said, you're now, you're officially without Smotis. He's going to miss the rest of the terminal, but he's still on the bench helping you out, and you have Slokar back. What does that mean? For sure, you know, uh, Smotis, you know, is a, a big player and also a, a big leader. You know, you can see in the timeouts, you know, even in the halftime in the locker room, he always, you know, keep us up, you know, uh, with uh, some advices. And unfortunately, you know, he's hurt. Uh, I don't know, maybe uh, he can play at the end, you know, I don't know, uh, we're going to try to, uh, but you know, as you said, you know, Urosh is a big advantage for us, you know, another big body, and, uh, but we're going to need all uh, 11, 12 guys, you know.